Global swatches are one of the best things in the world and Affinity has them too, and they are a massive time saver. So to set up a global swatch, first what we have to do is grab the color and then switch over to the swatches panel. And you can see at the moment, we don't have any document colors, so we don't have this option in the dropdown. But if we go up here, click on this arrow and go add global color, and we're gonna call this color, yes, just because. And then what we can do is, well, we can refine the color further. In fact, no, we actually need to pick the color. So you could go and create the color and mess around with the color wheel, but I've got my color here already. So let's go and sample it. There we go. And let's click add. And there we go. We now have the document option added to the drop down. So any global swatches that you create will be added here. Now, if I wanted to change the color of all these stars, I would have to go and do this manually one by one. Not so with global swatches. So if I just select all of them, first of all, and let's say I'm working on some incredible life-changing illustration, and I'm now using the yes color green. Let's just click that. All of these stars are now using that global swatch. So if at any point throughout this entire document, I want to go and change this green to say an orange, all I have to do is open up the global swatch by double clicking and then drag this around and adjust the color. Or maybe let's go for pink. So simply by adjusting the swatch itself, it's gonna update every instance of that color throughout the entire document. 